know, man, the new comic industry has got to be threatened by technology, though. You know, the uh, digital only, four bucks comic. You know what's really terrible about no like that. comics now? Um, have you seen how cheap the paper is? A comic is the same pages, but it's like half as thin, just from this yeah. paper thin paper. Yeah, a modern comic actually takes up about half the uh, thickness. Yeah, oh yeah, for sure. That's why, remember when we bought that one long box of not even the stuff that's as new as now, but like 2011, 2012? He had like 425 in one long box. Yeah. That was the guy that had the yellow house out in Santa Clarita. Or Ventura or something. We still left a box in Ventura. Yeah. I didn't go the knock on the guy's port. door and then make him an offer on his lawnmowers. We bought a lot in Ventura, where it was... Uh, that was like was the showcase box, too, that had all the best stuff in it. Yeah, the guy was deceased, and it was his son kind of laboring over the estate. And the dad, I guess, was a hella collector. And he had 10,000 books that we bought for, like, I don't know, 500 bucks. Yeah, it wasn't much. Yeah, it was cheap. Um, but we actually did pull some good stuff. You know what I pulled out of there? I pulled, pulled out... First appearance of Venom, which is like Spider-Man 300, it's hundred dollar book. He had Ultimate Spider-Man number one, which is kind of one of the modern keys. But the guy had like a backyard with like 20 or 30 lawnmowers. And that was his other oh, wow. collection, comics and lawnmowers. Yeah. So we were like moving all these boxes through aisles and stacks of lawnmowers. It looked like the junk town in Labyrinth, you know? <laughs> Did you ever read the, uh, the sequel? To them. Oh no. Because they, they did it as like a five pop manga. Yeah. Little mini. Yeah. Oh, it's elaborate? Yeah. I've never read that. Yeah, it's it's okay. It had some, a couple of good parts, but on the whole, it's it's far. You know what? That inferior. is definitely a spider bite. You know how you can tell spider bites too? They don't itch that bad, but if you scratch them, then they itch like hell. You know, just leave them alone, you know? I don't know if I get one, I usually lance it get everything out yeah, of it. Yeah, that's what I may do. But I want a little fresh air in my room so I don't keep it sealed. The window has like a little crack. Even if you sealed it, spiders still find a way in. Yeah, they do. Trade you the salad for a print. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm waiting to see my uh, my new friend uh, down here. He makes didgeridoos and glass. Oh, yeah. yeah. No, I actually met him at the first uh, like craft fair that I did. Okay. Yeah, he's he's been around for a while. I mean, he's young. I don't know how old, but I mean, you know, when he's still. I got one of his tie dye shirts. Okay. It was like pink and orange. <laughs> <laughs> Nicole has it somewhere. Yeah. You know, what? screen printing is one of the things that I want to try soon. Yeah. Well, you, you could do screen printing at home. Yeah. I mean, it, it's not that hard. See, no. you know what shirts I want to put. Um, I mean, what images I want to put on a shirt. Get like a, a sand yellow or even a sage green like this and do the, the original Dark Sun art from Gerald Brom and do a complete Dark Sun without even did the word Dark Sun dark on there. Dark Sun uh, shirts? I don't no. even think they did. No. Like even in the back of the, the module. Or even some stuff? of the old D&D &D art. And what would be cool is you wouldn't make it all commercial by putting the logo on there. You would just have the art and people in the know would know yeah. what it is. We're the only people that are in the know. Yeah. Nobody cares anymore. Set it up. The woman? You can go rob the uh, clothing store for the rack. Rat had some of those come in. Stuff like that comes in. They got tons of that stuff upstairs and you know that they can't use because they don't have space. I don't know what they're going to do with it. You know, just Sell wait, it, people wait, wait these until they like open it. a new store and then they're, they're going to use it to furnish the new store. They're going to never open a new store. That one's they've, gonna they've, got more than, they've got more than one. They've got at least yeah. two. Does the other one have all the good stuff? I don't know. I've never been there. It's in like Santa Clarita or something. Wow. Yeah. At least they look like a decent couple. That one at the uh, AMPM. Yeah. 
when, when you see, like, like how, how yeah. do chicks like that get guys like that? Because, well, you know, like, my I'm, tenant is in that situation. <laughs> yeah. You haven't seen her boyfriend. The guy is... I, I think I might have just, like, very briefly, you know, through the window, through the blinds or just, something. Just an odd pairing. Yeah. Even an odd pairing based on... He looks like a bigger, dumber Robert. Yeah, kind of. You're right. And an old Robert, yeah. not even a young Robert. Um, what Robert... What we thought he was going to look like when he got older. Yeah. Instead, now he looks just like his dad. Yeah. Robert lost a lot of muscle mass. You know that? He what used... happens when you sit in front of a computer? All That's yeah. all he does. Remember? He was like the, one of the toughest guys. At least we thought he was tough. You know, from his taekwondo and stuff. Uh, martial arts don't make you tough. Well, he fought his dad. Did you see the fight? No. It was in front I, of his... I, was, I think I was out of town at that time. Yeah. I think the dad took it easy on him. I mean, Robert was bragging to me about it, but uh, I, I think the dad, because Robert was throwing like leg kicks him and stuff. Him and his dad out. are like real good friends now, according yeah. to the last thing I saw on Facebook. But and he never talks to his mom anymore. She's like the outcast. His mom was nice. That's what happened. His sister lives in Texas. Fast. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I mean, his van is getting so bad, it almost looks like a, a, a crank <laughs> or something, you know? Well, at least the inside is somewhat clean now. Yeah, it, you've improved it a little bit. I made my wife out and clean it up. No, you know, my mom is doing her art. That's why she's not doing this week. Uh, she's teaching a quilting class at 50 bucks a person up at the German bakery. Did she have a bunch of people go, or? She only needs a few students. Well, I know, so. but did she have any, or? Yeah. And then another show as well. So there's a first Friday in, in uh, Tehachapi as well, but they charge. It's like 35 bucks a table. No, this will be the last time this chair comes. Next time I'm going to have a, a good chair. Something like yeah, that. Well, I have that stuff like this. Time, too. <laughs> yeah, it's to just kind of dig it out. I love that. Part two of two comes in, and part one of two hasn't come in yet. Every time Angela texts me, that's what happens. All the time. Yeah, he's got his Comic-Con flyers out over there. Get more batteries. You know what is a cool craft that I wouldn't mind doing? I've seen people do. You ever seen handmade fishing lures? I should go. Not difficult to do. Yeah, I guess, yeah, just the hand wrapping it. Yeah. See everybody's stuff real quick. out here today. Got my comics, some art, and I'm just gonna sit here and draw for people. Cool. Just hang on my board so I don't forget it. If <laughs> <laughs> my memory sucks. I just took a picture of me sitting here with all the, the flyers. So I'm gonna stick it on the Facebook. <laughs> Because I just opened up a contest today. Bakersfield Comics fan, a contest. Create a Bakersfield Comic Con mascot. Win a free lifetime pass to both Bakersfield Comic Con and Bake Anime together. Oh. So whoever creates the perfect, and I stuck a picture of it. I just, actually, I just stuck something up and said, you know, there's my <laughs> two minute job. But come up with a, a mascot and whoever designs it, and I even put in there, no age limit. Uh, if a four-year-old has the best image, great. I want just want the design. That'd be good. And the best design, you know, keep it clean, be creative. My four-year-old loves Everyone, going to the. It doesn't cons. have to be a superhero. If drawing a skunk is the best design. That's what we'll <laughs> use. Whatever the best design is. Must be on. Uh, and the winner gets a free pass to Bakersfield Comic Con from now till when it till I cool. can't do it anymore and bake anime. Uh, what medium does it have to be in? Can it any be digital art? And I even wrote that. Uh, must be drawn in any medium you choose. 
on paper no larger than 11 by 14. Okay. That was the post. And, uh, wow, it's already gotten a whole bunch of likes. <laughs> and one person did ask a question. How many entries is someone allowed? No more than two entries per person. Okay. So, I'm pushing that. Okay. Well, that's good. Yeah. yeah. Should be fun.